Welcome back, demigods, monsters, and gods alike to the Olympus Report. It's time for Camp Half-Blood Incident Reports. Clarice hates a lot of things. People, puppies, Percy Jackson, and apparently music. Name Kate, Kevin Seven, date September 5th, 24. Time, 6 a.m. Details of incident. I was singing along to musical songs, House of Holbein from six to be exact, really loud because I had a sugar high, blamed the stoles when Clarice came into my cabin and punched me in the face. I don't really blame her as she actually felt bad because when she punched me, she didn't only break my nose, but my glasses and now I can't play capture the flag until I get new ones and you know how she feels about capture the flag. Wait, why do you feel bad? She should feel bad. You sing as loud as you want, just maybe next time lock your cabin door. But Cabin 7's woes don't stop there. Name Sophie, Cabin 7, date, I don't know, Wednesday I think. Time, two-ish, details of incident. When I was claimed Apollo's sun symbol lit my hair on fire and Percy tried to put it out with water and the force of the water gave me a black eye. I don't think we can actually blame Percy for this one as he was trying to help. Campers, please don't stare directly into the sun. Name Anna, Kevin Seven, date September 6, 24, time 9th. Details of incident. Got temporarily blinded from how bright Will was. Well, I guess technically he is the sun. And it wasn't only the sun part of the sun and the star duo that caused problems this week. Name Anthony, Kevin Seven, date September 7th, 24. Time, dinner, details of incident. I accidentally told Nico that he needs therapy and his Cocoa Puffs attacked me in my sleep. Hey, everyone needs a little bit of therapy. Campers, please be careful of unsolicited toast. Name, Abigail Bloom, cabin four, date September 8th, 24. Time, around breakfast. Details of incident. I walked out of cabin four and was walking towards breakfast when I ran into another camper and they offered me a slice of toast for my berries, so I did the switch. Later that night, I ended up in the infirmary from something they put on the toast. Was it cabin 20? Never put anything in your body from cabin 20. And finally, speaking of being cautious, also make sure you get enough sleep. Name Phoenix, Kevin Nine, date September 10th, 24. Time, noon. Details of incident. Fell asleep on the climbing wall and rolled off. Thankfully, the camper missed the pool of lava or otherwise this could have been way worse. And thankfully, that brings us to the end of Incident Reports. Until next week, I'll be signing off. And please, as always, stay safe.